What's up, YouTube? Back with another video. Uh, I never really wanted to do it like that, but uh, let me rewind it. Um, bang! Back with another video. Um, I haven't done a vlog in a while, uh, as you guys can tell. I probably look a little bit different from my last vlogs. I had a hair. You feel me? I keep cutting it, keep growing it. But yeah, man, um, sooner or later, I'm probably going to do a, a wave tutorial. I'm going to let my hair grow back out a little bit more and really start brushing it. Um, as of right now, like... Because I'm mixed, you know, I'm Panamanian. And then my pops, uh, he's American. But, uh, what is it? Um, Yeah, my hair's straight. I got straight hair. Like, once I cut my hair, it's super straight. So, I don't even want to deal with it right now because I'm not going to get the results as of right now. I got a couple friends that's growing their waves out. You feel me? It's a competition type of ordeal. It's funny. You know, it's all funny games, man. Until I win. <laughs> you feel me? But, um... But yeah, man, uh, I just want to hit you guys with another banger. I apologize, my fault. Um, yeah, story time, as you guys can tell. The time I cheated on this girl, and I scored 24 points, right? Um, hold on, give me one second, I apologize. <laughs> Feel me? My goodness, I look good. You guys can't tell me I don't look saucy now. But, um, yeah, man, um, the time I cheated on this girl, um, I scored 24 points. So, it was in middle school, right? Um, I was dating this little, this girl at the time, that little girl, because I was still, I was still a kid at the time. Didn't know any better. I mean, um, don't cheat kids. Don't, don't do nothing. Don't, don't hurt people's feelings. Because, um, it's not a nice thing, you know what I mean? Don't. Once you get your feelings hurt, you'll tr trust me. You'll you understand that that's not the great, not the greatest thing to do. But um, where can I start? I was on the seventh grade team, right? Uh, seventh grade team. If you guys haven't already, go check out my last mook bang. I'm not gonna do a mook bang for this situation, as, uh, as you guys can tell. But I'm just gonna give it a short uh, story time. But the time I cheated on this girl. She, uh, we were in seventh grade, and, um, so on the seventh grade team, made the team, right, and, uh, doing pretty well for myself that year, right, uh, skinny, I lost a lot of weight as, um, in the mook bang, if you guys watched that one before, I lost a lot of weight going to my sixth grade, seventh grade year, I played football that summer, came back, I was still active, drinking a lot of water, I stopped drinking Kool-Aid at the time, and pop, and all that stuff, so, my body was starting to cut down from a lot of things that I was doing to myself as a kid. Drinking Kool-Aid, pop, all the bad stuff. But long story short, um, I ended up ended up having what I was averaging like 12 points a game, 15, something like that. And um, the crazy thing was a lot of girls was like, oh my gosh, like, oh my gosh, you're... You're crazy. You're a great hooper. Thank you. I'm, you know, cool. Shorty, all that. I love you too. Shorty, so love. That, you feel me? But, I didn't love them. You feel me? I didn't know what love was in, in middle school. You feel me? You say that, you didn't know what she was talking about. But, she ended up finding out I was talking to some girl. I don't remember who, what, who I was talking to, what I was doing. But, I ended up walking to the locker room because that's where we had to meet at before every game. We ended up meeting up there and stuff like that, and, um, well, no, run that back, my fault. Throughout the day, something was iffy, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if she caught the vibe, or the girl said, or the girl ended up hitting her up, or telling her, like, I have to tell you something, like, the vibe was kind of off. So I'm trying to figure out, like, I'm looking around, like, what's going on here, like, you know what I mean? Because a lot of girls would do that. Definitely if they like you or whatever the case was or if they feel that they should have you instead of the other girl having you. So I'm looking like, all right, man, I ain't got time for none of this goofy stuff. I'm just trying to have fun, man. I'm trying to live my best life. Because I was. I was I was popular. Not saying that popularity is the best thing because it's not. You know what I mean? Sometimes you get in trouble for things that people only know you about. So long story short, I ended up walking back to the part where I was walking to uh I was walking to the locker room she ended up stopping me and she was like well have a good game like she was talking normal so I'm thinking to myself like all right man I'm good I'm not in trouble like cool like I'm like I didn't get caught today like and see man I'm gonna tell you guys this 
Don't try to have yourself look over your shoulders every day. Cheating is not the answer, man. If y'all don't want to, if I'm gonna keep it a buck with you, if if you like another girl, man, break up with Shorty. Break up with her. You're better off breaking up with the girl, so then you can be like, you know what? I didn't hurt her feelings. At least, at least if you try to get back with her, you got that chance, man. A lot of people, a lot of a lot of people will be like, oh my god, oh. they want to cry over this. Like I know a lot of guys that that did wrong and try to cry over the situation. Like, come on now, bro. Like you goofy. So all I'm saying is this, man, like, be smart out here, man. So, uh, long story short, she, uh, she was talking to me normal. She gave me a hug, gave me, gave me a kiss, the whole nine, right? So in my mind, I'm thinking everything's smooth. You know what I mean? Like, I'm cool. I'm chilling. I'm like, man, I'm finna have a great game. You feel me? I'm finna go dumb. She... Literally gave me a kiss, turned around, walked like five feet, right? Stop. Like, I'm looking. Like, I'm waiting for her to hit the corner so I can watch her, you know, watch her go. So, she stopped. So, I'm texting. I'm texting one of the guys. they like, hey, bro, hurry up. Get your stuff. We got to meet over here in the uh, foyer. So, I'm like, all right, cool. Say less. I'll be there in a second. I'm just watching uh, my shorty walk off. And, um... He was like, he was like, alright bro, just let me know when you get up in the locker room. So then uh I just wait for you. I said, cool, cool. I'm about to be there like probably like two minutes anyway. Tops. So she ended up, she ended up stopping, of course, turned around and was like, Oh yeah. I heard you was talking to who off the band. I'm like, who? In my mind, I'm like, first of all, I'm not even talking to Shorty. Like, Shorty like me. She texts me. Yeah, me being a kid, I was dumb. I, oh, yeah, sure, you like me. So I, I texted her back, but it was harmless. Def, it was harmless because I didn't do nothing. You know what I mean? So the fact of that, I was like, so what is she saying? Well, this, that, and the third. Like, you like her. You're going to break up with her. Like, you feel me? Like, all, all wild stuff. And I'm thinking to myself, like, did I really say that? Like, like, I got the messages. Like, you know what I mean? Like, even though I said some foul things. I didn't say all that, you know what I mean? Like, I wasn't finna do all that goofy stuff. So long story short, she was crying, like, I hate you, this, that, the third, like, you, you, you're, 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 you're hurting me, you're breaking my heart. I'm like, I'm like, dog, I apologize, but if, if you wanna break up with me, you gonna break up with me, you know what I mean? Like, even though, even though, like, at the time, you feel me? I had, I had one of the cutest girls in the in the in the middle school, so I'm like I'm like Loki Loki hurt you feel me out damn Cuddy tough tough. So I'm looking like man, I'm looking like damn I'm like Loki I might I might end up losing Shorty, but then I then I thought about it. I said you know what man, I'm not gonna even trip bro. I said you know what I'm a, I'm a, I'm a kick back bull out you feel me? If she wanna break up with me she'll break up with me. So. Literally, I was like, I was like, just text me after the game. You know what I mean? Like, and usually she wished me good luck. She ain't wish me none of that. So now, so now I'm looking like, I'm like, dang, she not rocking with me like that no more. So I'm like, what the hell is going on, bro? So literally, I'm into the part of my head like, damn, she ain't wish me good luck. She ain't showing me like, she ain't showing me the love how she really would. If everything was cool, so I'm like, damn, I'm like, what the hell is really going on? Like, what is these girl? I'm like, what is these girls putting in her ear? So then, I get on the bus. I'm texting the other girl, like, what are you talking about? Like, I ain't say I was gonna break up with my girl for you off the band. Like, you bugging? Like, you just want some attention? This on the third. She's like, and so I said, so you really own it? I said, you want me? I was like, you could have just told me, like, look, I don't feel like shorty is this that for you. You know what I mean? And I would still tell Shorty, like, no, nah, I don't I don't want to be with you. You know what I mean? Ordeal. I remember getting on the bus. And she was like, I don't think this is going to work out for us. So I said, dang, for real? I said, that's how you feel? She was like, I don't think it's going to work. She's like, because if this is how you feel, why would you show any other girl attention besides me? So I'm looking like, look. I'm like, I'm not trying to argue before this game. I said, just hit me up right after the game. I was, I was, I, no matter of fact, I was like, I'm gonna call you or text you after the game. I said, that's cool with you. She was like, yeah, that's all right. So you know, when people say all right or okay or 
yeah, that's fine. You already know it's not. So, so in my mind, I'm like, dang, I, I really messed up. But I was more so mad I, I got caught. <laughs> I was mad of the fact that I got caught. I wasn't mad that she wanted to break up with me. I was mad I got caught. You feel me? And that's, and that's messed up to say. Cause I didn't really care for the situation, but I was like, dang. I was like, I'm foul. <laughs> but long story short, we got to the school. Seventh graders always play first. So in my mind, I'm like, all right, man. I'm like, all right, man. I'm, I didn't know what I was doing. You know what I mean? I was, I literally blacked out. That's the first part of the story. I blacked out from hooping, of anger. I said that wrong. I blacked out from anger while I was hooping. And when that happened, I was dogging these mugs. You feel me? Straight hooping. Ended up running. Running up that 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 joint, you feel me? Um, ended up dropping twenty four on them boys. Something slight, you know what I mean? It's slight work. It was more so that they couldn't even they couldn't keep up. You know what I mean? I was angry, and when I black out, it's not a good thing. It doesn't matter if I'm playing any sport, whatever I'm doing. If I get upset and I black out, it's gonna look bad for you. You know what I mean? And I was so upset. First, I think the first point I got the ball went straight to the cup, to off of it. You know what I mean? Going into the half, I had like 14. Didn't know. My coach didn't tell me that. He didn't tell me, yo, G, you got 14 points or nothing like that. He was basically like, damn, I got what? You know, everybody was like, yo, bro, you got like 14 points. So going into the, into the second half, I came up on... I came up on 20, the end of the third, and then uh, going into my fourth quarter, I ended up dropping. I ended up dropping four more points. I could have had 28, you dig, but I missed some layups. You feel me? Because I was I was just so frustrated. Anger, flare was was running up. But the thing is, man, everybody didn't understand that what was going on that day. Everybody was so happy. I was happy I scored 24 points, man, but. It was a it was a meaning behind it while I was really hooping like that and people didn't understand the fact of why I really went crazy like that, you know what I mean? So it was a messed up situation, but hey, it is what it is. Like you feel me, I I did what I had to do, you know what I mean, for my team. Yeah, I felt bad for that situation. But um like I tell everybody, man, don't don't do stupid things, man. Cause when you do stupid things, Stupid things happen to you. Karma's a muff. Getting beep. You feel me? I ain't gonna cuss because I know I got younger audiences watching this. But uh, karma, karma's something else. And I don't got time for all that nonsense. You feel me? But if you guys like this video, please like, comment, share, subscribe. I appreciate everybody that is tuning in and supporting the the uh the movement, ARTM. Um, as of right now. I'm going to let you guys know. Um, I might be going to ShoeCon. Not ShoeCon. It's like a sneaker convention. Not really like ShoeCon, but it's something small in Madsen, Illinois. Uh, Saturday, May 12th. May 11th. May 11th. May 11th, May 12th. It's on that Saturday. So whatever number that is on that Saturday, that's the day I'm coming. I'm coming to kick it with y'all. Um... Please share this video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know your guys' thoughts. And, um, yeah, man, I'm going to be back with some more bangers. Uh, as of right now, I really ain't been dropping too many videos, of course. More freestyles are coming soon, man. A lot of music is coming soon. Um, I got some things in store for you guys, so just stay tuned, man. The movement is really, I'm about to start turning up on these guys for this summer, man. This our summer. Go follow my boy, Adonis815. Swervo two times, you feel me? He changed, Brent Isaiah changed his name. So uh, y'all definitely go shout out to my boys and them. Y'all go watch their videos, share, comment, all of that, man. Run these boys up, man. We out here doing positive things. Y'all y'all always want to see negativity. Why? Because y'all want to feel better with yourselves. Y'all lame for that. Y'all goofies for that. Go support the good causes, man. Go support the goodness of people, man. You feel me? But I'm out. Salute ARTM the, the movement, you dig?